Can I ask you to pivot your resources and increase our supply of these materials here? Purpose being? It's to bolster the town's defenses. I've designed a few new measures that should give us a fighting chance. My ideas can't hold a candle to Miss Iris's, but I offered what assistance I could. I helped out too. I don't usually waste a firecracker mind like mine by shackling it to practical matters. I mean, where's the art in that? But this is for all of us. Damn, it feels good to break my own mold. Your sacrifice is appreciated. Huh. Give an architect an inch and she'll take a league. It's all very impressive. But what about this talk of surrender? You're asking for a lot of heavy lifting just to raise a white flag. We don't know what will happen yet, so we prepare. Does this really merit debate? She's right, Guildmaster. I'd rather break my back now and try than regret it later. We may well break our backs and regret it later, but if the measures are necessary, then I say we do it, sir. It seems worth the effort. Uh, twist my arm and you might even get me to break a sweat. <gasps> ha! I'm ready to hit the ground running if you'd make your damn minds up. What is this? I feel like I tripped and fell into an old memory. All right, all right, protest withdrawn. You just give me your list and on my guild's honor, I'll make sure we deliver. Heave! Ho! Organizing the stockroom, Sumire. Eh? I sure am! Gotta have things ready to bust out in case Nola and everybody need to run off to war, you know? Bust out? Yeah! Rummaging kills all the pre-battle momentum. I wanna be like, boom, here you go, so they can be like, boom, here we go! Figured that's the best way for me to help. <laughs> well said, Sumire. Something tells me the student is starting to surpass the teacher. I knew from the day I met Noah that he's somebody you can trust. When my brother and the other village kids were in trouble, he went out of his way to help. He's not gonna back down this time, either. And neither will I. When Noah dashes into the fray, I'm gonna be right by his side. Let those Imperial scum throw ten, even a hundred legions our way. They ain't getting past the arena and our Dark Knight defenses. <laughs> My rune lens aches! It calls for battle! I'll be ready to battle too, for the lives of any soldiers who are wounded. Or we could just not run toward danger. But that would be the sensible thing. Just don't let anyone get killed. Less than that I can work with. I'll be there to heal, so you can focus on the important thing. Which is ripping those imps into ugly little pieces! Yeah! Let me at them! So, will the commander fight, or will the commander break? Bigger question is what you plan to do. You wouldn't be the first sellsword to miss roll call when faced with a losing battle. Hell, it's stupider not to run. The Sawads honor their contracts. If Noah chooses battle, then I'll fight till the last drop of blood leaves me. Should I worry about you? <laughs> Count me among the stupid. Even if the lady weren't depending on me, which she is, Noah's gonna lead us down the right path. He's a good man, that one. Well, if you're gonna be stupid, I'm gonna be stupid. I'm gonna be the last one standing, so suck on that! I know I didn't drag my carcass across the sea just so I could run away with my tail between my legs. I'm here to eat, and this battle's the main course. I don't need to face death to feel alive, but I won't abandon all the incredible people I met here. Of your stain, Sabine, 
I am too. I know. I count you among the good men. You can keep talking about this if you want. I'm gonna go polish my blade till it gleams. I don't know what the fuss is. They have a paragon of magic like me to rise to the occasion. Nothing could possibly go wrong. Yup, it's time for the good guys to smash up evil. It's like that magical tome I read when I was little. Dark Lords, epic battles for the fate of the world. And the art was so good, I couldn't put it down. Battles like this are what magical girls were made for. Say your prayers, Dark Lord Aldric, cause my lore's coming for ya! Indeed. I too must survive this test, or there will be no reaching the lofty magical apex I seek. But come what may, I will fight until my every last muscle point is drained. The Elden Realm saw a war much akin to this one, but time marched on. Fear not, my pretties. The Eldritch magic I wielded then will see us through the now. I don't know what good I'll do, but I'm ready to use these meager talents as best I can. Bah. Once I hold dominion over the thrall I seek, no army will be able to stand against me. Dad, I'm scared. Are we gonna die? What? <laughs> We're not gonna die, baby girl. Not while I'm still hopping. <laughs> you don't believe me? We'll pack up and leave right now, yeah? Lie to me. Huh? Parents like to think their children are too young to see, but they do. Come on, Garil. She knows you're not gonna run. Hey, butt out, yeah? It's okay, Alibi. I won't let him hurt you either. We're gonna get through this. Your dad won't run, because he doesn't plan on losing either. All right, can I just do the parenting myself, or... Dad, not everybody has such great friends. You won't run. <sighs> Look, you're my number one. I am not letting anyone hurt you. But there are some fights you just can't run from. I know. I love you, Dad. Your Majesty... What will happen to us? Something? I don't know. Whatever Commander Noah decides, I will never stop fighting to retake you, Chris, and restore his majesty to the throne. Neither will I. Thank you. But I don't think it will come to that. Curiel believes in Noah. She knows he's not so readily broken. Yes, sir. Boy's got strength and adversity written all over him. Hmm. Perhaps so. One day, she'll see that I'm not either. What's to become of us, milady? There's no telling what he'll decide. Oh, please. That's the only part that's obvious. You're that certain, then? I don't bet on a losing horse, Melridge. The boy will make the right choice. I know it as true as anything. His noble spirit is no less than your own, Countess Groom. Oh, why thank you, my lord. Well said. I, for my part, believe in him too. So what happens now? Yeah. If the Alliance decides to surrender, what's it be for us? Well, we certainly won't be going back to the Empire. Unless we want our necks stretched for desertion and treason. But... We could always flee to some remote area, keep the Resistance going from there. There's always a chance sentiment within the Empire will turn against the Dukes. The opposition movement could grow. 
Even if it comes to that, I'll never stop fighting. Think you could take me with you? It would be extremely dangerous. Oh, I know. But you've all fought so hard for me and my sister. And I want to return the favor. Me too. We... We'll both fight with you. You're very brave, the both of you. But you don't have to worry, Milu. It won't come to that. How do you know? Because I know him. Hustle, Collies! Hustle! Our final test be so close, I can smell it! Aye, for true. No approved is valor to us on the sands. He'll not make the wrong choice now. We must be ready when the order comes. We fight not just for him, but for our own future. I owe Noah a debt of gratitude. My spear will dance for him like none have seen before. I know it's a battle of a lifetime when I seize one. And you won't catch this rising star turning tail. Running's what other dwarves do. Not this one. Yeah! The big bad's in for a lousy time, cause I just built the ultimate deck. A poem, then. Hope begins a slender flame that carried by all no tyrant can tame. So, what happens now? I'm gonna assume that's a rhetorical question. Pull me. What do you mean? Far as I can tell, Noah isn't the kind of fellow to give up at a time like this. Agreed. So what happens is that we get ready for the battle ahead. This isn't over until we bury the Empire and liberate Yarnan. End of story. The Guardian's duty never changes. We fight when we must, where we must. Ha! Yes, that's exactly right. I suppose I should worry less and prepare more. <laughs> Thanks for saving me the trouble of coming up with a pep talk. Guys! Guys! Don't worry. Noah's not gonna throw in the towel. I'll bet my whole box of tools on it. We should just go ahead and start supplying up. Ah, good idea! I'll get these chopping arms pumping and cart back all the lumber we could ever need. You don't need to ask me twice. I'll get you so much ore that you won't know rock from stone anymore. Yeah, okay. You're getting a little wound up. I mean, I'm not saying we won't win, because we will, but... <clears throat> Anybody need their bag fixed up? If you're heading out to gather stuff, you don't want to be the only sad sack with a satchel situation. <laughs> we may not have a lot of time. I think I'll look into scrounging up some more runes. Whoa, my gal! Don't leave your pal Dykstra in the dust! Where you go, I go! All right. If I want to keep everyone armored, I better start laying in some stock. You won't catch Frida sending her troops out there a pauldron and gauntlet short. You just keep the lenses coming, and I'll keep them purring. Tell me what you need, and I'll set you up. Might even stop taking a little off the top. I'll stay by the forge day and night, and hammer out weapons till my arms fall off, if that's what it takes. Just see if I don't scrounge up the sparkliest, most eye-catching assortment of accessories there is. If there was ever a time to keep the shelf stocked, it's now. I'll make sure of it. Well, my name is Mud. Let's do it! Do it. I am the shining golden warrior. When a battle is near, I do not cower in the shadows. See, you gaze upon the glory of a true hero. And what is Noah, if not like me? 
<laughs> that whippersnapper has already made his mind up, and when he tells me to make my spear sing, I will. Ho <laughs> ho Perhaps I'll make some real sparks fly like I did in the old days. Marin, you know I would never put you in danger. But this is a battle we can't avoid. I know, Wyler. We'll stand tall together and help our friends. Thanks. I swear on this bow that no matter what comes our way, I'll see you and the whole Alliance through it. They're gonna need runners, and I'm ready to run, run, run! Just give me a message, and I'll zip it on over to where it needs to go. Destiny has knocked me to its bow, and I am ready to fly true. But will I find my mark? Bubba, give us a vision. What's gonna happen to us? A vision? Whatever for, child. There should be no question in your heart whom victory will favor. <sighs> busy, busy, busy. There's so much to do. The troops will need a hearty meal before going to such an important battle. And let's not forget the victory feast. There's not a moment to spare if we want those tables spilling over with roasts and pies and the rest of it. Don't worry, I'm ready to flex some culinary muscle. The only thing they'll be hungry for when I'm done is more victory. Sometimes all you need to turn things around is a great meal at the right moment. Mm-hmm, you are what you eat. So we need to make sure they eat the very best. One thing about Noah. That boy never, ever gives up. And that means we've got to pull our weight, too, and help him out. Then I'd better start picking out my tastiest veggies. Sit tight while I catch you the most fabulous game you've ever laid your pretty eyes on. Right. I'll grab my pole and hit the water. Oh, hi, Noah. I thought I'd set up a little space where people can listen to music. I'm counting on you to look after my dad, okay? Oh, and you're welcome to join me for a few songs whenever you feel like it. I left my village to see the outside world. But for all the ways this place has made my heart sore, I cannot say each day was one of joy. Still, I have learned that good people are out there, if you look. One of them is Noah, but there are so many more. And if these people are not worth fighting for, what is? I will fight Leaf and Frond to protect them. Go, Alliance! Go, Alliance! You'll have the power of the Stone Lion to help you. I didn't become the mightiest of all beast warriors for nothing. Go, Alliance! Oh, oh, I'm gonna help too! Go, Alliance! <laughs> Worry not! Noah will make the right choice. I think I know how to pick my spinned ears. Yeah, Doc. There's no way a top rival like him will turn his back on a challenge. I've gone head to head enough times with the guy to know he won't make the wrong play. Look at all he did for my roly-poly little darlings. Noah will never stop looking out for us. Exactly. It's the whole reason we're here. History is a stage, we the players. And none can say where the final act will take us. But as the climax approaches, I feel more and more that our tale will end happily. 
<laughs> He'll go for it. He will. I saw it in his eyes. I shouldn't be here. I have medals to make. One for Noah, one for him, one for her. Oh, we can all have one. What greater achievement than defeating the Imperial Army? I think what everyone needs is a good soak. That'll get us all in the right headspace. Just see if it don't. Well, Noah, have you found your answer? I can't stop thinking about one thing. What's that? Was I the wrong person for this all along? My choices have affected so many people, and it just doesn't feel right. Cousin, come on, please! When you told us you were forming a resistance army, we pledged our lives to you, remember? There ain't been a moment since that we regretted it. That's right. <laughs> since they regretted it. Yes, sir. We made up our minds that very night. Just so happens you're a man worth risking our lives for. As are the ideals you believe in. So you can stop all this second guessing right now. Your heart knows what is right. It always has. So trust in it. Thank you all. My feelings haven't changed since that night. I feel the same now, even as I stand here blessed with so many new friends. So thank you. I know what to do now. Good. If you're not sure of yourself, your soldiers can't fight. A leader must cling fast to their beliefs. Spectacular. I was wondering when O oh Great Captain would become O oh Nearly Excellent Captain. Huh? Wait, I was still only great? Huh? No way! Did Emir just make a joke? Bad form? Nearly excellent form, I'd say. <laughs> Now I've truly seen it all. If you're ready, Noah, then lead us onward. Straight and true. So, Commander, have you come to a decision? His face seems to say yes. Noah? <sighs> We're going to keep fighting. We're going to stop the Empire. If there was a way to save all of you by turning away from this, I'd do it. But the Jukes will never allow it. We know what he did to Yelu's village, and what he's beginning to do now in Haishan. He's going to end so many lives. I know what I'm asking of you won't be easy, but it won't be beyond the realm of possibility either. So I say we fight! and protect as many people as we can. Now that's what I like to hear. Poopy poo! Yes, yes, I do like the sound of that. Let's rise up and fight again, as when we first defended Haishan. Sharks never shrink from a chance at glory. And this battle will be the most glorious of them all. Here, here. We must put a stop to Aldrich's barbaric reign. See? I knew I chose the right person. That said, what we need now is a strategy. A way to win the war against the Empire. Melrich? With all respect, Commander, that is a ludicrous request. We'd be lucky to defeat the Imperial Army in a single battle, much less a war. So it's impossible? The word I used was ludicrous, not impossible. Besides, 
I know a worthwhile challenge when I hear it. Sounds like you have an idea. First things first. We must reinforce our army by gathering as many of the scattered Eucrisian and Noristari troops as possible. In addition, there is another small military force to whom we might appeal for help. I knew I was asked here for a reason. Something tells me you've had this ludicrous plan in your back pocket all along. <laughs> Guilty as charged. Can we count on the second son of the Fawad clan? Well, I'm none too keen on looking my brother in the eye again, but I guess it's time to swallow my pride. The elves are likely to be drawn into this conflict sooner or later anyway. Oh, are we? Relax, Lilowin. I'm not gonna punch him in the face this time. That's not what I... <sighs> so there you have it. Good Alway here will be our emissary to the elves. Appreciate it. No problem. I'll figure things out somehow. Permit me to gather the Eucrisian troops. And the Guardians will get our butts in gear and track down what's left of the Norse Sturries. Commander Noah, now would be a good time for you to seek out new allies as well. We must act before the Empire makes their next move. Now let's get to work and win this war. Oh, we're going to win, alright. No matter what. Let's go find some new talent! Hey, no problem! We can do this!